chemistry is a wonderful contribution to culture because if you understand its principles and how it talks about the world, you're put, in, you're put right into the middle of science. On the one hand, you can understand the physics that underlies chemistry. And on the other hand, you can reach out into applications of chemistry, like those which explain biological processes and organisms in general. So it puts you right into the heart of understanding modern science. What I wanted to do was to share with you my vision of the principles of chemistry so that you know how chemists think as they stir away at their, at their liquids and boil their, their liquids and distill their liquids. And I also wanted to show you why I think it provides the what I call the infrastructure of the modern world. Take away chemistry, take away the products of chemistry, and you're back in the Stone Age. So I want to enable you to look around, look at the world through a chemist's eyes, look at the world through eyes that enable you to enjoy the colours of nature, to enjoy the, what is going on around you, to enjoy how a fabric is made, to enjoy how a semiconductor is made. But I also don't conceal that chemistry brings out problems of pollution and environmental damage. And what I also try to do is to show you how we chemists are trying to avoid injuring the environment, finding ways of clearing up. And I leave it to you to judge whether we are providing you with material comforts with insights into the workings of the world that outweigh some of the difficulties that at the same time, I have to admit, we, we introduce into the environment. But at the end of the book, which is a pretty short book and much shorter than any real chemistry textbook, so don't be afraid by, at, at opening it. And indeed, I avoid all those off-putting formulas and structures and so on and just try to take you into my confidence and share with you my love of chemistry and insofar as it goes my understanding of chemistry and I hope at the end of it you will if you're one of those people who hated it you will have changed your mind a little and if you're one of those people who loved it then you'll see, see why other people should be encouraged to love it too.